This is Airways Week of 2020. Our future starts now. We are Little Stars. My name is Bill. My name is Leo. My name is Chelsea. My name is Conan. My name is Tammy. My name is Danny. And we are from IIU. We are young. We are dynamic and creative. Speak up for the ocean flow. We would like you to spare a minute to recall the moment of seeing the ocean for the first time. How was that feeling? Were you amazed by this gorgeous blue color? Did your eyes wide open with wonder and joy like this little girl, Mana? Did you love to play with the water in the waves? Did you bend down to pick up some colorful seashells on shore? Did you get your hair wet and your feet sandy? And did you wish that you could stay a bit longer and explore the ocean more? If you answer yes to all of those questions, then I bet you have a very beautiful childhood. And you are definitely an ocean lover like me, like Moana. But wait a minute, have you ever listened to the ocean? Have you ever wondered what it did down inside its soul? Have you ever known that the ocean is in pain? Have you ever felt what it has been suffering? I bet the answer is no. Then, let me show you. The only truth is, we, human beings, have been destroying the ocean and its marine life by climate change and plastic pollution. Corals are bleaching. Fish, turtles, whales, dolphins, seals are dying because of a huge amount of plastic is swallowed. The sea is crying and begging us for saving itself and its abundant marine life. That's very sad. Why would the humans do that to our wonderful ocean? The sea gives us a lot of benefit. Firstly, the sea is a place that provides protein and vitamin from the seafood for billions of people. It also creates more oxygen than Amazon rainforest and can live without it. Do you know the weather will be colder because of the ocean? Isn't it amazing? And last but not least, the sea is a home for many marine animals like coral reefs and fish. Without the blue ocean, they would die. In the Disney movie Moana, the sea loving, headstrong, fearless teenage Moana risk her life, setting sails outside the reef to return to her sea fishing to save her people and her ocean. In real life, a sentient piece of guitar fearlessly ticket what leaders at the United Nations with a powerful spirit. How dare you for not doing more to tackle climate change? Right now, we are here at Iowa to help our world heard to speak up for the ocean flow. If people keep polluting the environment, the ocean will be terrible one day as we will lose all the wonderful marine creatures. And what if the sea disappeared? And I know that you would never want to think about that. Things will get worse on our planet. All the plants will be gone. There will be no way to get us back to the way the Earth should be, unless we care for it. So take good care of our planet before it's too late. Humans, please stop using plastic. Let's tell ourselves, please stop using plastic stuff. Let's tell our friends, please stop using plastic cups. Let's tell our parents, please stop using plastic bags. Let's tell our people we know, please stop plastic waste. This is not a job for one single person, this is everyone's job. Do you know why? Because saving the ocean blue is saving our childhood, our lives, our hopes, our dreams, and our future. Together, please stop ocean plastic pollution. 